Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm finally doing the video you've all been waiting for, so let's jump right into it. Um, basically what we're doing is we're comparing the Wish app sponge. Now the Wish app sponge is, it comes with four sponges in a pack for a dollar and then it's dollar shipping. So in essence, it's like 50 cents a sponge if you really wanna look at it that way. That's this one here. This is already wet. And then I finally got the Beauty Blender sponge. This is the original Beauty Blender. It came in this kit here. I kind of opened it because I had to take the, the big pink one out. It comes with a blush blender. It's, made, it's meant for your blush. And then the little tiny one is for concealer. And then this little block here is actually the cleaner. And this is what it looks like here. I want to say it's $38, so we'll just call it $40 bucks with tax. Um, you know me, I was like really hell-bent on not spending $20 on just a sponge. Um, so I asked the girl, and she said, yes, this is, the, this is the original beauty sponge that's in that kit. So I'm like, okay. It does look a little bit more pointy than the one that is by itself, but I just went off of what she said. She said this is the original beauty sponge. This is how bouncy it is. If you guys have it, you know that's how bouncy it normally is. This is the Wish one. So, I mean, obviously the Beauty Blender is a lot more squishy than this one is, but this one's pretty squishy too. So we're gonna compare, we'll call it the $20 versus the 50 cents. That sound about right? Okay. So I'm actually, I already have my face primed. So what I'm gonna do, this is strictly foundation video. I'm not gonna put on a whole bunch of makeup. I'm gonna start with my Tarte Shape Tape. This is my ride or die. Um, this is my ride or die. Hold on one moment here. Okay. The Tarte Shape Tape is my ride or die concealer. So I thought, why not just use that one? That way we know if it works or not. Now, usually when I put on foundation or concealer, I use brushes. I'm a, I'm a big brush girl. But everybody and their mom's been talking about the Beauty Blender for years now. So I'm like, I have to try it. We will do the Wish, wish side this side and the Beauty Blender side this side. So let's do Wish first. Now I'm not crazy about how this works under the eye already. That's why I use a brush. but we'll still go for it. Just so you guys can see. It's actually working out a lot better than what it normally does. I kind of, I don't know if you could see the little like creasing. It doesn't usually do that when I use my finger or a brush. So that's why I don't like using any type of sponge. So I think the wet from the sponge is actually getting into the product. This is still a little wet, so let me just squeeze it a little bit more. It is really, really squishy. Great, I think I got something in my eye. Awesome. <laughs> okay, now we're going to go with the Beauty Blender side. So far, I don't really notice a difference. Let's see, do you guys see anything? I got a um, mirror right next to me. I don't see the lines as much on this side that I do this side. I don't know if you guys can tell. All right, so let's go on with the foundation. I'm actually gonna mix two of them. You guys know I love my um, True Match N4. I actually bought this Clinique Beyond Perfecting foundation, so I'm gonna mix the two of them because this one's actually pretty light for my skin. But when I mix my um, True Match, it actually blends pretty good. So I'm just gonna add some dots throughout my face. So guys, what's up? I haven't seen you guys in forever, it feels like. I tried uploading a video from my iPad. This is my phone, my V10 phone. 
I tried uploading a video that I, I made a couple weeks ago. Actually, it's, it's been a while since I've, I've made this video. And my iPad says, sorry, your video's too long. We can't upload it. And it's only like, it says we can only upload videos that are 15 minutes long. And that video was like almost 17, not even quite 17. And I'm like, are you freaking kidding me? So I didn't have a video out last week because of that. So I do apologize. It was up and ready to go. And I didn't want to sit there and try to figure out, you know, what to do. I didn't want to edit it either. You guys know I don't really like editing my videos because it kind of loses its essence of like you guys like talking to me and, or me talking to you guys. What the heck is that noise? I really hope I'm not going to like break the bench. I had to stop this video because Mer was about to jump on the table, so I'm like, let me just put you in the other room just for a little bit. Um, this is actually my lips. I still have the dye from another lipstick from yesterday. So that's what that is. I didn't bite my lip or anything. Okay, so now that I got the foundation all over the place, this is the beauty, or wish side. So we're just gonna do couple dabs guys I've been obsessed with this website called you now have you guys heard of it it's basically live streaming 24 7 like whenever you like people all over the world um, I did a couple get ready with me's on there and ask people like oh what color you know what color lipstick should I do? Should I do this and that? What should I wear today? Stuff like that. And then like you guys can get to know me. I get to know you guys. I can actually um, cam you guys up. So I'll put the information in the description box and in the comments. It's called You Now and my name on there is Tonya2483. YouTube. I put YouTube at the end of my name because I actually had another account, but I don't go on that one. So that one is just like a ghost, like nobody's on there. So you got to go to the one that says Tonya2483 with, um, with YouTube on the end of it. This, this always happens on the side of my face here. I don't know if I'm blending it wrong. I don't know if I just have a dry, I think I have a dry patch of skin. on my face so just try to just kind of ignore that because this happens every day I don't know what's going on with my face so this is the wish side I mean hello this looks good right for a 50 cent sponge that doesn't look bad I probably should have did this one first but oh well you guys can see I know some people use this side to blend, but I always just kind of do the side of it. That's just how I do it. So what do you guys think? Do you guys notice a difference? You know what I have on my lips? I have ColourPop Cozy, and I had it on all day, and I kept blotting my lips. Mwah, 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 mwah. Kept blotting, kept blotting, kept blotting. And I think that's why it kind of just like stayed overnight. But yeah, my lips are fine. It's just, the color's still on there. Um. Okay, so what do you guys think? I think this side looks a little bit more dewy, actually. You guys, do you notice a difference? Because I don't. I think I truly, truly found a dupe for the Beauty Blender. I don't know. Both sides look good. So this is this side. This is this side. What do you guys think? Give me your thoughts in the comments below. Um, 
I like them both. I'm glad I finally got the Beauty Blender. It is nice and soft. Um, it's nice and squishy. We'll see how that block, how this thing is to clean from the kit here. This one here. So yeah, I don't know if that kit's still available. If it is, I'll leave that in the uh, description box too. I got it like the tail end of February maybe I got that kit or the beginning of March, something like that. So yeah. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I love you. Again, let me know what you think. You think the Wish one did a pretty good job? Um, from what I'm seeing here, it looks like it did. Uh, yeah, if you want me to do any more videos, let me know. Love you guys. Bye.